Hey yo, it's me, Creeps, the guy who usually does analysis content on PUZ2 for some reason. I want to take a break from that, so I thought I'd upload stream highlights of me playing a mod called Outverse. It's the mod I generally recommend people to play if they haven't played PUZ2 mods before, though I won't give a full sales pitch. This mod is created mostly by Parson Sergio. Sergio, whatever. If you want to catch me live, I plan to stream Outverse every Thursday from 1pm GMT to 4pm GMT. So yeah, come check it out if you want. Oh, and I may or may not have forgot to press record immediately, and so I lost a few levels of footage, so most of the tutorial will be skipped. Lucky you. Okay, let's go. Is it just me, or is the plan animation in the stream so much smoother than when I play myself? Yeah, actually. Uh, PZ2 is hard capped to 30 FPS for some reason. It's not that I can't run higher than us, it's just it's set to 30 FPS. A lot of mods just set it to 60 FPS, and I think now there's an option to turn it to 60 FPS in game, but I'm not too sure. Too fly cord here. Peter, how do you get here? Unusual appearance, use for Peter. So you know, just still attacking class, best slow enemies down. Don't mean literally, I mean to stop them, I'll just ignore for a while. So especially if you don't rush in, that's the rules. Potato mine strategy. Brilliant. Shouldn't you have like a different version of the C packet for Peter here? Like, you can actually just make like a separate repeat of C packet, so you have it like so it has a mon day C packet. I can actually just be a bit nicer here. I've never thought about that before, but yeah, you can do that. I guess I can do it. It's not probably available. Really? I guess it's buggy. My, my mistake. <laughs> they don't normally move that slowly. I guess my speeder wasn't on. Sorry. I still want to have sunflower from sunflower. Clearly, they'll use my idea of being introduced plant food. That's clearly what's going to happen here. I can confirm. I'm, I'm technically a beta tester, so I actually know this information. <laughs> but yeah, if this is going to be a casual playthrough of this, I'm not going to use the challenge rules at all. Just to make it very clear already. There are a set of rules called Venn rules, which basically just make the game harder, but by just disallowing certain mechanics and things, like Moe's not allowed to use, I believe. Uh, you can't use the implants, and you have to play a level of specific order. I think it's boring and dumb, so I'm not going to do that. Just letting people know. Because vet rules kind of suck. So true, vet rules sucks, I made it. Exactly. Oh, hello. <laughs> Ground spawn jump scare, I see. <laughs> well, we have a source. Apparently we are goaded or whatever for the uh, internet slang is at this point. But hot sauce? The attack I bought from you earlier. Good try this, hot sauce on it. That'd be so good that I might want to travel back in time usually again. Are you gonna question why the zombies dropped this? Nope, they're not. Cool. The tackle's great, but the source is kinda of stuck in a bottle though. Anyways, it's time for a big fight. The basic plants, we need basic zombies, it should be fine. Okay. Yeah, whoa, I wonder what's gonna happen. Hmm. It's, it's almost as if I've been here before, and I know exactly what a twist in this level's gonna be. Well, who could have guessed? Anyway, fun fact, I'm pretty sure portal zombies don't count towards the ways progressing facts faster. Which... okay, sure. Game mechanics, I guess. Laser bean. Go do laser bean things. Citron, go do citron -y things. Uh, walnut, I don't need you. Honestly, we flourished. Windermelon is actually pretty bad. Not for reason everybody thinks so, I think people are wrong about why. Uh, this is a bit of a tangent, but in Reflourished, Sapling is so broken as a staller that everything is worthless in comparison. That's my theory on it. I don't know why I've said it here, but that's my theory on it. And my, and my joke was that Windermelon has actually changed here. Windermelon is now single lane. So, yeah. Da, 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 da. I love this song. Da, 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 da. I'll have to wait for the zombies to spawn. Pain. Please spawn quicker. Please. Okay. Wait, where's the port? Okay. I forget how portals work. I think you just made a time machine. I already named it. I don't know if there's a note in the hot sauce ball. Can you have a look? That's why I saw the portal sauce. Let's read the note. It says, Dear homeowner, I came with a multiple plan. I can't think of it now, why not do it in different areas? So I did exactly that. Bad and tingly puny prepare clan plants my various My various timely army in addition. All these actions should warrant me a victory. This letter was immediately you don't just surrender, right where you stand. P.S. There repeat was a text up there. Just test up jam, taking it back. What? Can get all that out. That's the Mr. Boss guy I know. <laughs> it's alright, it's just gonna be the same and then the same. Interestingly, the zombie dropped a golden key. Never uses cover timelines. 
Blah, blah, blah. Let's go for time. Let's go. Traveling for time. We're going to go to Thanksgiving. That, that'd be quite nice. And thus, we begin proper. Please don't memento. No, it wasn't funny. Yeah, you should be fired. You, you're really bad at writing dialogues, SP. I believed you were better than this. I can't believe you're just so unfunny. I've seen the Chili Fest bloody dialogue that didn't get released for public. How did you fail that badly? <laughs> yeah, no. Oh god, look at the Conad. This is what I mean. I have to put, like, a potato mine down because I can't kill the Conad otherwise. <laughs> oh dear. And what lane take the longest to kill? This one. And this one. There we go, we did it. We beat Egypt. And then we get worse pea shooter, apparently. <laughs> Man, watching a 25 sun meta mod playthrough is kind of boring. Be right back, being helped by 50 sun meta. Oh no. Oh dear, I love 25 sun meta. I always will. I have a soft spot for it. I am bad for that. <laughs> Play cabbage, you coward. Honestly, I will. The cabbage is actually slightly better for me, and that's because this plant food is so much better. Peachy's plant food is honestly worthless. Cabbage's plant food is actually really good. It's like one of the best in the entire game, I think. At least for its price range. Like, it's really nice. At least for right now, it's like the best plant food you get for a while. Can't think of anything better right, for a while, usually. I guess repeat is fine. It can kill a Garg, I think. I should love camels. They're such an impactful zombie for every level they're in. Look at how incredible they are. Look at the massive impact they're making. Your opinion on the Wolfie plays Fully for Flourished? I'm watching most of it, but I think it's really funny to watch. It's not skilled by any means, but it's incredibly funny. <laughs> funny, I'll be honest. Camel sounds nice when they die, so don't mock them. Well, we got our first fancy special here. I can't believe they've had the mod which doesn't introduce Tomb Fest as the first Tomb Fest. That's a spoiler alert. <laughs> and Explorer as the first AE special actually does something. I have a pulse now fire faster. Oh yeah, I forgot about that, yeah. Because you changed it because you were annoyed at people complaining about it. Yeah, I remember. God damn it. Tomb Fests. Tomb Raisers, not Tomb Fest. Bloody hell. Well, Graves, Blooming Tax and help us get through this. Always try out new plans whenever you get them. They should be very good in the very day after. There. Almost like this was well planned ahead. No, I'm not tanking off game. No, screw you. This is a 25 cent meta mod. The turbo button is basically on by default. I'm not tanking off. Which is worse. Like the symmetry, symmetry of an annoying tone message. Eh, good question. I don't know. Put in the comments below what you think is more annoying. <laughs> oh dear. Turn off your turbo button. The game's asking you to. I think the game gave up. <laughs> It just gave up displaying the message at this point. It really wants me to, but I'm not doing it. I did not actually know if the game would stop displaying a message in any circumstances. That's fairly funny. Anyways, finally, look, we I have to I get to not do filler. Bag of coins. It's like a minimum wage pay for grocery workers. Oh no. Fancy level time. If you don't know, in recent versions of PZ2, they removed mummy mummy memory. So Altverse made a new one. So yeah. These are things in the title. So I break these, things happen sometimes. And there's like several different types of graves and things. Like, this is zombie grave. They'll spawn a zombie. Shocker. Did you hear about Kai's game's PvZ1 ability back? Yeah, and I broke it. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm noticing that the phases and the graves ones have very different quality. Oh well. This kind of happens, I guess, sometimes. You know, can I just break all of them and just spam cabbage plant food? Go! Cabbage, go! <laughs> okay, the level's now done. <laughs> Cabbage plant food OP, please enough. What's the mod you recommend? This one. Alverse is the mod I recommend to basically anybody new to mods. So, yep. Again, Discord and download in the description, so go do that. It's alright. Not simple. Plan plan plans, break phases, destroy game sounds. Nobody memories anything. Why are you pointing it out? Because they have a memory of a goldfish. What's that have to do with this? What's that have to do with this? Brilliant. Funny explorer man's here. So, yeah. Now we get to look at all these plants. I actually thought the... Do I show up in I want to show these guys off. Yeah, we do. Okay. Look at these guys. Uh, basically, just to explain this, uh, the game's going to explain it at some point anyways, but at a certain point you can unlock community levels. Being these community levels will give you gauntlets. With these gauntlets, you can buy these guys. They're quite neat. <laughs> Don't question why Chili Bean is here. Orchard. Yes, he is here. They are here. <clears throat> Void Orchard looks very menacing, but she's aware her actions are the most ethical. I never want to be transforming so abruptly, she sighed. That's probably why I always lose the arcade annual to Witch Hazel. Puffins are just the most much cuter compared to Gravity Spheres, apparently. I hear the guts. I've never done that voice in my life before, but apparently I did. Uh, it's Orchard, isn't it? It's not Orchid. 
I don't actually know how you say that. I, yeah, I'm not gonna question it. Orchards with shades of spawn sweet potatoes. I mean, on a technical level, sure, but... Uh, like, if that means, like, a bloomerang is a piece that pierces, like... It changes a lot, you know. Now, don't get me wrong, it's very obvious what it's made from, and that is technically an issue, but still. Everyone who paid for staff with raging mess available receive packets after a random PC2 update. A lot of, like, premium plants are like that. Like, Explonut is, uh... Something else is that I can't remember right now. Law plants. <laughs> I hate conets so much. We're being sworn by bloody conets. <laughs> Why are there so many? <laughs> Jesus Christ. We had a hidden conets and how they like you. Well, I'd like to see less of them, please. I, I know I gave them fame on an international level, but please, I don't want them. I guess you. Go. Wait, there's still, still a conet behind? <laughs> okay. Hey, we got iceberg. We got a solar. Nice. A big conet. Surprise conet. The conet nobody saw coming. We finally got the first actually really good plant food effect. Thank God, we almost have an actual deck now. Whoa, I can't believe it. It only took seven levels to get an actual deck running. I probably kill this raw zombie. He's carrying he's carrying like a thousand sun at this point. I keep not picking it up because I'm reading chat. Go Razom, go Bloomerang, please kill Razom if I get my son back. Thank you. Look at all the sun I missed out on. Depression. No mod except for maybe Ecclesis popular or flourished. We flourished is more popular than Ecclesis right now, I think. By a long shot. In most of my videos, I don't receive a million comments saying to play Reflourish, but I re Reflourish. I don't- In most of my videos, I don't get a million comments saying that I should stream Reflourished. Everybody's wanting me to stream, stream Ecclesi. No, everyone wants me to stream Reflourish. Nobody wants me to stream Ecclesi. I'm pretty sure Reflourish is just more popular. Ha! Uh, Iceberg, go. I win. Oh, I have to wait for the basic come on screen. <laughs> that was a mistake. I'm sorry. We did it, guys. We beat Egypt, Egypt 7. We can finally do, do non-tutorial stuff for a bit. Whoa. Uh, thank you to Poss because we have a Pinata party. I talked to Poss about this before and today's party didn't show off something, so... We have a special party today. Thank- say thank you Poss, who's not in the chat anymore probably, but we'll see. We have a plant as planned. But luckily. Luckily is a very interesting plant. Because you can see here... It can't grapple onto Blockly at all. Blockly is immune... Oh, it's one of the few plants, one of the only plants in the entire game. Rip that. But yeah, Blockly is one of the few plants in the entire game which is actually immune to fishermen. It also does this. It's also a wall, but that's less important apparently, I don't know. Is he immune to in the base game too? Yes. In the base game, Blockly is immune to uh, fishermen. I don't know why, they just made it that way. I don't think anybody's ever actually used that trade before, but here we are. Pop! Pop! Okay. <laughs> I should probably stop saying it, I think you're all getting a bit sick of me saying that. Pop, pop. Pop. And pop. Sound effect's nice, actually. Pop. I hate this thing so much. I do not understand in any scenario where you would actually use this thing as you're intended to use it. Pop. Pop. And pop. Oh. Just. Go. Explode. Explode my doom shrooms. Wreck the entire screen twice. Well, that worked quite nicely. So yeah, there you go. Oh, wait, I thought we were done. <laughs> God damn it. Die, please. I'm trying to finish off, because I'm trying to help Poss do some do some little bit of showcasing of things. There you go. God. But you survived like one HP. <laughs> Pain. <laughs> there you go. We did it. So yeah. Can you play now? Yes, you can. Different Pinyar party. Whoa. Could I ask Poss specifically to, to get that one? Please end! <laughs> please! <laughs> I've been waiting for like 10 years! Come on! <laughs> so yeah, get some loots. 300 coins, a total seed packet, and a new costume for Sunflower. Whoa! Awesome! Cool! Unfortunately, it's still not the best one, so, you know, it's fine. These are like your kind of plants and such. So, you want to pick a plant, this is how you do it. You get a good Sunflower costume. It's not the best one, though, it's not the witch hat one. So yeah, you do this, you get, some, you get to work, work for some of these guys. There are a huge slush to them, so you can kind of just do whatever you want. I personally am wanting to get this guy, because I like Toastal. This plan's guaranteed. Who would have guessed? Toastal. <laughs> ah, yes, I love hard code. Oh, that costume kind of lame. Yeah, I know. 
I would rather like a different costume, but oh well. Life sucks, apparently. Honestly, I might get rid of this costume because I don't like it at all. <laughs> Is that too petty? It might be too petty. I just really don't like this costume. You go for free, don't complain. Hmm, true. But it's kind of bad. I'd rather just have default sunflower, honestly. <laughs> Anyways, I feel okay to say that was too easy. Two people got the joke and are laughing now. Just to bleed me out of life. That's not bleeding at two. As long as I saw the ritual, driving the undead from the ground. For necromancy. They get, you think you'd get normal humans that way, but that's not how it goes, I guess. Hmm. Also, this is a reverse Amogus, I'm pretty sure. So, yeah. I said it. It kind of looks like it to me. Friend of mine's grave layout took care of you, Amogus. <laughs> Wait, it's randomized? <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> oh, that's even better. <laughs> God damn it! That's even funnier. It's fine, the bloomers are getting rid of them. It's all fine. It'll all be over soon. The, the Among Us can't hurt, hurt us anymore. It, it's like, two, they're like, probably like three years ago. <laughs> Punished for not running Great Buster. Apparently so. But come on, I'm not running Great Buster. Great Buster's lame. It's like, I don't like running Great Buster. I don't need Great Buster. I have Snoopy. Oh dear. Well, they should hopefully be level pretty much over. Of course, he's one greatest with it too. I guess you need to make sure it does something, but we're fine. Because Bloomerang is overpowered, shockingly enough. Every X9 level in each world is gonna have a gimmick like this, so get used to it. Uh, one of them is uh, Necromancy Power Tiles, so that'll be a fun one when we eventually get there. Bloomerang, more like what it's literally been. Lazy Bean wishes it was shredding this level as hard as, Blaze as Bloomerang is right now. Don't diss my boy, he's, been abs he's just absolutely hard carrying us here. What a nice sound, sound to my eardrums, it's so good. <laughs> oh, we went already, nice. The sound is quite a nice sound thing. Mm, maybe for you, it's not, not so much for me. I, he's having to actually explain how to defeat plants and get the brains. Unfortunately, zombies can't read. Neither can I. No, I never actually noticed, actually there's like little plants everywhere. Oh, there's a cherry bomb. Wait, you knocked Cherry Bomb in Pirate Seas. H how is Cherry Bomb here? Wait, was Cherry Bomb originally meant to be an AE or something? Huh. I never noticed that before. Wait, there's a ladder too! There's a ladder in the walnut! Like, in a third column. I've never noticed that before, I've never actually looked at this. Huh. That's actually kind of neat. There's a note from Zomboss on, on the back of a Papyrus. <laughs> Dear Desert Dominator, I can't honestly say that I expect you to own a time machine. Back here left was meant to be a mock-up, but it seems that it actually, actually backfired me. No, back here I left was meant to- Back here I left was meant to was meant to be a mock-up, but it seems that it has backfired me. <laughs> oh no. But it is fine. My plan is not completely in vain. This massive mummy horde will overcome your organic defense. The glisten of Papyrus, yeah, will no longer be a sketch, but a record of history. Sincerely, Dr. Edgar Zombos. Was meant to, was meant to. Was meant to, to meant to. Sans imp, sans imp. I sometimes wonder where he got all these confidences. Wait, I sometimes wonder where he got all these confidences from. It's P! It's P! <laughs> Neighbor, show him what we're made of. Carbon, hydrogen, oxygen, po. No, 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 I didn't mean that literally. The rank has been pretty funny as far. Yeah, it's P is actually pretty good at rank dialogue. He just kinda sucks at, uh, proofreading it. If he proofreading skills, they could turn out then. Yep, basically. Like, Zan like one of the Tess's jobs, Zanberg, is basically the entire purpose in life is to make sure he doesn't make too many mistakes. He's great. Can he really beat I've Lost My Magic, though? You can't beat I've Lost My Magic. It's such an iconic <laughs> walnut quote. It's so good. I love PVZ. PVZ is awesome. <laughs> if he actually makes Dave an idiot, that's something. I don't know if Dave, Dave is kind of a weird character. I don't even know if he's really meant to be an idiot. Like, I have the comics, actually, and... I don't know if i describe as non-idiot. It does kind of seem like the standard, uh... affair they tend to characterize him as. If not even stupider. He is a very... interesting character. David Super Genius. Yeah, there's like an entire plotline in the comics where... Crazy Dave is creating... Like, an entire subplot where they're dealing with, uh... Zombosses bullying history. And Dave just goes off to off on an ice cream petition to eat the ice cream before it melts. He fails to get so depressed he makes unmeltable ice cream. Uh, the multiple ice cream then stops the on bros from killing everything. So, you know. <laughs> PVZ lore. I wouldn't exactly call 
crazy they've done, idiot? He just so happens to be incredibly lucky. <laughs> oh, look, seriously, I've got like plans every single tile at this point. Oh well, should we ask money? Oh no, we can't know for sure. For now, we have conquered the Egypt. The Egypt. Nice. Where and when do we go next? Let's see. We're going to sail the sea. No, we're not. I've always wanted to ride a boat. Driving all the other time sure is boring. He's a Dave. Oh. Depression. <laughs> yeah, it's the only Egypt. Uh, we've got a sapling packet. A stinky packet. Whoa. We did it. We got a new world. What's this? Time space map. It should be an only your land of a guy to a guardian. Each one holds a key to the next world. Okay. So yeah, right now Althus goes all the way up to Tongues Avenue, the well beloved of vanilla world. And <laughs> uh, no. It actually goes up to near Mississippi, which is the most recent world of release right now. Uh, but we are currently teasing the next world after, which will be Big Wave Beach. So yeah, we have a lot of worlds to go through. This is the original release order for the most part, which um, I think it was like just, you know, Big Wave Beach pushed back around here because Big Wave Beach is stupid. What the heck is Timeless Avenue? Once in a different universe, gardeners used to compete in battles to win powerful new plants. Here, those same plants reside in the appropri properly named community levels. Thomas Avenue is community world. Uh, it's busy filled with levels made by the community. The two parts of it, which we'll get to like 100 levels from now, yeah, we ha this is happening soon. So I really was lost money. Because look, now it goes beyond 10. Now it's called H -H X. What's X supposed to mean? It usually was extreme, but I think in this case it means extra. So extra is only supposed to beat. Neat. I'm already done this more than just that. For now, we have two choices. Go to the next world, or continue on with the extra territory. Choices or not. You always have your choice at any time. Not gonna be locked or anything. Well, choose it. So, yeah. I'm gonna be trying to complete all of these worlds from start to finish like this. Because that's how I play these kind of things. Let's get going, shall we? Uh, first level should always be easier, but we don't really have a lot of plants yet, so we kind of want to do this. Some boss pulled a sneaky on us. He installed an obje objectivinator. Ah yes, Perry, the Objectivinator! <laughs> oh no, in our house. From now on, we have to complete objectives set by Zomboss and not survive a zombie attack. If we'll do either of these, we cannot progress. Can't we just throw a thing out the window? We can't. It says, do not touch on a side machine. Just go get the cabbage costume. Oh yeah, and you get a cabbage costume! <laughs> I forgot about the cabbage costume, oh no! But yeah, but there's like a cabbage one here, which is free. Yeah. We did it. We got a free costume. So yeah, from this one onwards, the grades are actually set now, so that's nice. No more Among Us, that's great. Yeah, thank god. <laughs> we never have to deal with Among again. They will never be with us ever, ever again. Uh, didn't Popcat botch that cactus change when when Omega Two Suns went targeting balloons? I believe they fixed that before release, I think. But yeah, that was a thing for a while. I'm actually not sure if they actually fixed that, but I'm pretty sure they fixed that. They didn't fix it. Oh, okay. <laughs> well. That's unfortunate. <laughs> Popcap is a very high. Popcap is right now is a very, very much has all the manpower they need to not make silly mistakes. I feel really bad for him, honestly. I ignore Gary. He's just chilling. Silly troops expecting Popcap to resume that it works. Listen, there's some things you shouldn't have to like be surprised at being a thing. Okay. Okay, please. Funny broken plan is here. Let's go. Bonky bonk. Bonky de bonky de bonky de bonk. Bonky de bonky de bonk. Keep in mind that we already unlocked a new, new era to go to. He finds his he likes AX, find his levels too hard, he come back later. But you find normal levels be hurt too hard, you like to doing more EX levels for better plants. Okay, Penny, cool. A Bong Choi has received a balance change. It now hits really, really, really hard. Like, insanely hard. It's, it's insanely powerful. Like, honestly, I may just not even have to do anything at this point. <sighs> Let's do a double of Bing's Bong Choi, why not? I'm bored. Let's get maximum DPS here. Look at my masterpiece of art. Oh, no, 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 dude. Peter, Peter, Peter. Tomb Razor, no, please don't. Please don't be a piece of garbage. You fool. You fall in the trap of giving me some symmetry. Okay. Yeah. I'm sorry to disappoint you, SP. I'm sorry. There are like three PZ content creators. Group 20, Zack Squad, and Wolfie. Eh, not really. There's a bunch of others, actually. I mean, the developer of this mod group puts their updates on YouTube, so technically they're all one. Uh, 660 does PZ videos every now and again, though he's a bit burned out. Black Zombie does some really nice analysis stuff if you're interested in seeing how the Chinese version works. Strongly recommend him, if you're bored. There's a bunch of other on the, on the ground stuff. <laughs> Come back near my second channel to you. And New Bling here does some videos on Cleese, oh, Cleese Beta too. So, you know. If you want to see more Cleese Beta stuff, you can go do that. Don't so keep coming. This time around, I'm picking some seeds for you. Oh no. I choose B6. Probably what Mr. Boss guy was thinking when he designed this. 
Heh, a lot less cool than free. Okay. Oh no. What what is it? I actually don't remember this level at all. I don't know most don't know most of these levels. Oh, this is a lot of grace. Oh, it's this one. Okay, this is fine. <laughs> the Trinity is pretty cringe, not gonna lie. It's just chili bean here instead. Just think about like chili bean. That's what it is. Uh, not technically, but it is just chili bean. That's what it's trying to be. Electricity is actually only here because uh I'll first law here, time. Sit down, relax, get cozy with your hot chocolate. Or your warm tea. You see, originally Outburst was built on the 7.8 version of the game. On the 7.8 version of the game, Chili Bean didn't work sometimes. Like at all. It was actually a really big problem and made pretty much every single version of Chili Bean practically unusable. So you see, what they had to do was they had to actually find a replacement for a uh, good old fashioned Chili Bean. And so Chili Bean was turned into electricity. Which is very, very much kind of similar. Like, it's, the shocks now do no damage, it doesn't attack by itself. And, you know, usual stuff. But you see, if it kind of gets them Chili Bean not being in the game, became a bit of a meme in the community. So you see, what ended up happening was that a while later they decided that they want to do a fancy event to celebrate Alva's releasing. And all because Reflush was releasing, so they had to do something fancy to keep up with that. So, they made an entire event based around Chili Bean. I'm not kidding! <laughs> This is actually actual true Alphas lore, and now there's an entire event dedicated to Chili Bee. And Chili Bee is now back in the game several years later. I really haven't actually talked about this level for the past like five minutes. Uh, it, it's fairly just bong choy go. Wild vs. Sunflowers that yet to come. I'm pretty sure my old Alp vs. Sunflowers stuff is actually really difficult. <laughs> so it's kind of why it takes a while sometimes to get out, because if they put a lot of them to make sure they actually do get the minimum. And sometimes they just like, get some really weird solutions, like. Uh, one of the levels had to use, like, electricity plant food to save a few sunflowers actually through the early game. Electricity food is actually really good, though. I've never actually used it. I don't think I actually ever use electricity plant food. But again, I don't really use electricity either. I always use, like, a uh, explorer node, I think it was. I always used. Because that was just how I played this game. <laughs> oh, is this level? This one's a classic. Seed save, I believe. So yeah, our catapults got buffed. We'll be seeing that probably next stream. But yeah. Carriage bolt! Carriage bolt. Colonel bolt got changed. It's a lot stronger now. We'll be using a lot of carriage bolt this street. Carriage bolt in this level because that's how it all works. And what this level's meant to play is that as the level goes on, you get better seed packets. So you want to make sure you keep your stuff, keep your uh, plants, well, in your hand basically for as long as possible. You want to make sure you get the good plants rather than the bad plants. So now we save our seed slots. Look at how slow the conveyor is going. <laughs> I probably need some more carriage bolts down, I think. I'll put another column down. And some more kernels, because kernels are better than couch pulled up, right? Repeater! Please, no, okay. Please, sir, I just want one repeater. I, I really need more repeater, I need more damage. Yay! Okay. Game saved. <laughs> oh, poor Gargantua! <laughs> that is an unfortunate place to spawn! <laughs> there you go, finish him off. Peter plant food coming in. Decent, I guess. I'm gonna start showing up these cabbages. Yeah, I, I do sure do love having cabbage in the morning. Uh, it's my favorite food. Can you tell? I, I always have it on my uh, sushi. <laughs> you have cabbage on sushi? I actually don't know. Cabbage on sushi is not normal. Okay. My bad. Okay, I think I'll mix up the seed. <laughs> I'm not gonna question it. Tombstone, hunt tombstone hunting time again. This is nice. Not to have literally. Set sense can be taken literally because they're now double half grays. Hey, that's playing jokes, it makes them less funny. Poor Dave. Dave is being bullied. Yep, yeah, see? Reinforced grave. I'm just trying to break some of these now just to make sure we get them sorted. I'm pretty sure zombie graves this time spawn buckets, I think? So, hmm. I'm very wary of that. I'm gonna hold on to this because there's a plant food coming up. Just put it back there, we'll use the plant food. Yep, yeah, these, these graves spawn bucket heads. Yes, yeah, scary. I'm actually not sure I can deal with me right now. Hmm. There we go, this is helpful. I uh, coconut can go! Go! Okay. Uh okay, this level should be easy now, I think. Now we got our plants up. In theory at least. Yeah, I think we got the graves down. We have like a few more graves left, which have to get done quickly. Let's try and click a bug. 
Uh, right now, the top of the make sure the grave dies, so double cannon, 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 and boom. Okay, well done. Two minutes on, two that's quite nice, it's quite chill. It's quite good. I like the mini game, it's quite fun. Save you when you plant iceberg versus plant food. Decide to ignore it. Yeah, don't, don't worry about it, it's fine. I guess I'll just keep I'll open some open yards in the end of the stream, I guess, for the hell of it. So yeah, if I get two of any plant, then I'll just stop focusing on that one. Explode it, nice. I like exploding it. Uh, Ghost Pepper. I really like Ghost Pepper too. Yeah. We really have just got one of every seed packet. <laughs> Re really, game. Why? I'll probably do some grinding off camera. As long as we do like a vineyard parties and maybe the endless, I'm unsure. Then on stream, so we can open some more of those premium plants and we get a few of those available for next stream. Next stream if I can. I've enjoyed my time here. I hope you've too. Uh, I'll make sure. I'll probably. I might do some highs of this stream actually. I'll see what happens. But yeah, hope you have a good time. This has been Creeps, and have a good one.